Jeez. It's like the game took this. What? Show me what the purpose of your life on this planet is. Teach me what it means to be alive. Wow. So yeah, the game took <clears throat> this weird turn kind of in this last quarter of the game where it's all like about technology and time travel and stuff. But it was always a kind of... Ooh, this is new music. It was always kind of about time travel and dimensions and stuff, but now it's all about like technology and circuit boards and... All right, so we're fighting fate. With the black and eight. Oh, it's gonna really suck if I have to reload and do all this again. So I'm gonna give it my best confidence here. Uh, I'm gonna wait around. Commencing countdown. Five. Uh oh. Diminish. It's not an attack that just halves all. Yeah, it's temporarily halved. That sucks, because I've been kind of working up to my big attacks, but... Oh well. An attack's an attack, unless unless I wait. I think I'll just wait one round. Four. So do I have to beat this before the time runs out? Or grab a tunnel. Ow, ow, you're squishing us. Ow. Alright, next time I'm going all elements then. I'm just... I was waiting to see... Hopefully not have the elements halved still. But now she's down to three. <laughs> Heat ray, uh-oh. Oh, just one person. 235, oof. All right, we're rocking an element here. Oh wait, you know what, no wait, Grobic has his, yes! This is my first summon. Summons death to wreak doom and destruction. Holy cow. I've been waiting 15 years to see this. And just any summon. Wow, that's crazy. Nice. Says about soon. 241, but... That's... that's fine. I was expecting a little bit more, but really it was just the animation that I wanted to see. That was crazy cool. Alright, now I get to use my... Flying Arrow. <clears throat> Would have been really cool if I could have used his too, but... I don't have the, uh, the field all the same color. Bahamut's still better. Grim Reaper looks cool, yeah. I may have to, after the playthrough, I may have to go, like, onto YouTube and find a video where it shows all the summons, because I'm definitely not going to be able to see all them, them all, or, you know, play through the game again that uh, will allow me to see them all again, so. Uh, let's heal up Karsh a little bit. I'm just afraid of what happens when this countdown goes. If we don't beat it in time. Uh, defend. Two, yep. Free fall. So, so far, the regular attacks and stuff... Oh, that was big. Haven't really hurt me. The elemental attacks. It's all about when the countdown hits. I'm guessing is going to be destruction for, for all. So I'm quite worried about what's going to happen. Come on, hit him. There. 
Hmm. All right. One. Oh, great. I'm worried. Gravity blow. Okay, that's just a basic... Just a basic thing. It'll probably hit me for a good amount, but... 55. Okay. Another gravity blow. Am I in trouble if I don't beat this thing before time's up? I have a feeling I may be. Oh, I almost have a full white field. Maybe I should try to get that. Well, I have a feeling zero is going to hit before we can get a full field of white. Oh, maybe I'll get lucky. Uh-oh, zero. Dark energy. Okay, so it doesn't explode, but it's going to probably do some big damage. Yeah, it does. Nobody's dead. Thank God. So let's go around to healing. Alright, so if it does the same process over and over again, I don't think it'll be that bad of a fight. I think we should be pretty good. I think we should be pretty good if it just does that same process over and over. I am going to try to see if I can get a full white field, but I don't know. I would love to see Kanor summon. I don't know if Grobic really has like, a lot of whites. No. Recommencing countdown, and then it's going to use something, so... Oh! Just a regular attack. Missed me the first time. Ha ha, photo beam, yeah. Alright, we just gotta get one more white attack in, and. Oh, but Kanor's not gonna be able to get up to a level 8. Uh, let me miss out. Ooh. How dare you miss? Yeah, I'm gonna have to take two rounds. I should have made sure I left at least one or two levels for Kanor's elements to have a chance at uh, getting his summon. Oh, he only has four stamina anyway, so. Oh, and I missed. I get it now. Our star rating is 38 of 39. Is that because I used the summon? So can you only use as many stars summons? Like, does that fill back up? Or do I now have only 38 more times I can use a summon? Is that what that means? This whole time I have I've had no clue what that means until now. That's sad that I didn't realize that. Wow, another miss? Alright, we're going to defend then. We'll defend with everybody. It's fine. Oh, I should have. Eh. That's alright. I'll do. I got to do another round of healing. I've been focusing on trying to get everybody to do their big attacks. That I'm not paying attention to what I should be doing. Still need another round of that. Yeah, that's how summons work. Okay, I get it now. I always wondered why it said this number out of this number, but now, now I realize because I had never used summons in the past years. So I get it now. Don't attack Kanor. Don't attack Kanor. Ah, oh, crap. That's gonna cut my cut me in like half. Oh no, that kills me. Are you kidding me? Oh, news. Oh, we've got 
a revive. Oh, and it's, uh, it's fatigued. So we got it on the ropes here, it looks like. We got it on the ropes. I gotta do an attack. I've gotta do an attack with Kanor. I'll heal up with Grobik or Karsh. Is there any way, Vizuki, if you know, is there any way to, to regenerate those summons at all? Or do you just permanently use them up and that's it? I'm guessing it would be like a permanent thing. Oh, crap. I didn't get the heal. Just don't hit Kanor again. Damn it. Okay. Whew. Oh no, that's right, a double gravity blow. She gets to do them twice in a row. Although, W Snipes, you can do it, uh, you can regenerate summons by sleeping. Oh, cool. What is up tonight? How are you doing? Or I should have said, what is up? How are you doing tonight? Sorry. I'm just all mumbled how I talk tonight. But regardless, anyways, what is up? But thank you, that's good to know. I won't use, use them up at all. But, uh, but that's definitely good to know. Oh, miss. Another miss. Are you kidding me? Can I beat this thing before it does its super attack again? I don't know. Oh. Zero. Oh, no. Everybody else is fine, but I don't think Kenora's going to be all right. 277. It got me by two points. All right, I really got a freaking... Oh, do I not have a revive? Did I not switch that back from the girl? I didn't put the revive back on Grobik. So, Kenora's out for the rest of the fight. Because I didn't switch it back. Are you kidding me? Oh, that bites. That really freaking bites. Just another evening dealing with fate. Oh, crap. Oh, that really throws me out of whack now. Kind of weird music now that I think about it for a fight like this. I can't believe that I did that. I didn't check that before. Ooh, good miss. I did use my one revive. Yeah, I did. That really makes me upset. Is that it? Is fate done? Kenora gets no perks. That wasn't as bad as I thought. I was two hit points away from being alive. Alright, though, we beat fate. That is awesome. And there it is. I know it's like happy jungle music, yeah. Oh, uh, look at that. We miss, Kenor misses out on all the fun. Grobik gets some HP, plus a level 7. Karsh gets 11, and a level 7 as well. Damn. Concentrate, feel the force. And we get a magic seal. Damn, I still can't believe that I wasn't more on the defensive side with making sure Kenor stayed alive. Damn it. No, how could you? I, fate, the goddess of fate, was not meant to die. That's not like the boss boss though, because Vasuki said we still got a ways to go. So now finally we see the other second main character that's on the freaking box that we saw for like the first couple hours of the game. Ah, uh huh, where places am I? Kenora, what happened to me? Ah, that's... that's it! 
And we've got a new crew member in Roxas 2FM. Thank you so much for joining our crew. Hopefully you enjoy your time aboard with us here. And now Harley comes into the to the thing. What the heck? Hey man, I love this game. Follow me back when you can. Good luck on disc two. Yes, we are on disc two. And hopefully we can finish this up, I think, next week when we play it. Because I don't think we'll beat it in the next 45 minutes. But thank you again for the follow. So Harley comes in here now. No touches. Do not touch. Kid, I know the feeling you have inside of you. The urge to bring everything to nothing now stronger than your desire to save everyone. You may want to throw yourself down the cliff of destruction. That is what your Im imperfect... I don't see I don't even know. I hate reading Harley stuff because I cannot do it justice. But Zavudla, kid. Uh, do not drag Knorr and the other, uh, the others down unto destruction with you. Shut up, you loony! It's too late. There's no turning back now. Uh oh. What did she do? Did she take it or bust the thing open or what? And there goes Harley now. What'd you do, kid? We finally see you and get you back on our crew, and you. Go and mess things up. Fate has fallen. Fate has died. Are we get to see all the dragons? <clears throat> Finally, the time has come. Indeed, the long endless night shall finally come to an end. Now for mankind. I shall make you bleed. Wait, who is who is you? Which you is he talking to? Feel the million years of this planet's agony, pain, and suffering. Are they all coming to help me, or are they going to combine forces and turn into Captain Dragon? Because all their powers combined. Ooh, a cutscene! Gotta love those PlayStation 1 era cutscenes. There's a nice charm about them. Oh! Okay. I remember seeing in the opening of the game this big thing. And now I remember that was a thing. And there it is. What the heck? Is is it a dragon then? Is they were talking about this seventh dragon that is supposedly a thing. Terra Tower, it's coming back to life again. In the year 2400, during a counter-time experiment, the flame goes out of control. This causes the dimensions to rip apart, resulting in the time crash. Engulfing an enormous dimensional vortex, Chronopolis was hurled 10,000 years back in time. Perhaps it was the awakening of Lavos who pulled the frozen flame back through time, back, back through time to it. Um, maybe so, that Lav... Maybe so that Lavos, who saw the possibility that some young adventurers might destroy it, could create a backup plan. But that ain't all. At the same time, another city from a different dimension's future was also thrown back in time. Dinopolis. Dy Dinopolis. The future city of the reptiles. They, they said that last time. It's not reptiles. It's reptiti rep reptitis. Reptitis. Azala's descendants who had involved more closely with the planet, evolved. Just as Lavos in the attempt to save itself summoned Chronopolis from the distant future. Perhaps our planet beckoned Dinopolis back to the past. Yeah, this, it seems like this game just went kind of woo, one way after being one a different way. It's just really weird. Maybe as a measure against Chronopolis and humanity. It wasn't the dragon gods who sealed up the frozen flame. 
It was fate which used power, flame's power to divide the seals of dragon slumber. That's a big cake. <laughs> and now that fate has been defeated, the dragons will join together again to start their revenge. Ah, okay. So yeah, I remember in the opening of the game and the theme music's going, you see all of the flying dragons. Okay. Now I get it more. Cool. What the heck? Wait, what? I thought they were all working together. Oh, are they attaching to each other? Okay, they're like attaching. To create Mega Dragon. Okay. So are we gonna have to fight this thing now? Okay, this is the thing that opens up. Yeah. I remember seeing that too in the cutscene. In the beginning. So do we have to fight this then? Or is it taking its revenge out on the bad guy? So, Captain Dragon. He'll take humanity back to zero. <laughs> Captain Dragon. <laughs> oh, okay, now I get it. He'll take humanity back to zero. I feared it would come to this. I didn't want to have to fight with you if you could have been avoided. If it could have been avoided. So now we get her back in our... Adieu, Kanor. Adieu. Where's she going then? She's going into the flame. And Kid passes out again. And there she goes. Zip zap. Out of the top. So I don't know what the heck's going on then with this game. <clears throat> and somehow we're off the island. Okay. Back onto the boat. Give me a freaking break. You mean to tell me that we were being used this all this time? Yeah. Damn. What is done is done. Although we may not like it. Okay. Uh, in any case, we need to make our way into that floating tower. Yes, we cannot just twiddle our thumbs and do nothing. The only problem is... So we have to find a way up there, right? It's not like the great SS Invincible can make it up there, either. There has to be a way. Hmm, at least our objective is clear. I do not know how, but we must find a way. So, like, whatever happened to the kid after that? Doesn't look like she'll ever wake up. Indeed. She is resting at Radice's place. Her spirit seems to be possessed by the past. A powerful item is necessary in order to dispel it. There's no sense in staying here. Come on, mateys. Let's shove off. Everyone. Yeah! So is that a good place, do you think? Uh, oh, wow, now we have access to everybody. Well, it's still our same thing, so. Good one. So for those that have played the game, is that kind of a good place to stop? Because um, I was planning on only going for about another half hour. So I don't know if, as far as where it lands on how much is left and whatnot. I just, I'm really trying to gauge on what we should do. So, first I want to heal up Kanor. <laughs> of course. Still can't believe that I didn't get to win the... Win the fight with him. So, how many characters do we have? Like, one, two, three... There's still so many that we have not come across. It's crazy to think that... Look at this. Look at all of these here. There's a whole section of characters that we just haven't come across yet. 
that's just crazy. Did we get any... What did we get? Did we get something new? There's something you can do in a half hour. Like, meet story-wise. You can't beat the game in a half... Yeah, I figured we weren't going to beat the game, but... Some side quests things that could get done. Ah, uh, forget-me-not pot. Magic seal? Was that what we got? We got something. I forget what it was. <clears throat> Let's save. So, without giving too much away, what direction 